to you. We have mixed fortunes with the weather this morning. For some of us, it's a cloudy start. There's some dampness in the air, but it will brighten up later. And for others, well, it's a bright start to the day. We've got clear skies and it's cold. And you can see that reflected in our current temperatures. Estill Muir, which is in southern Scotland, is minus one. Edinburgh, plus three. And then as we come all the way down to Cornwall, where we've got more cloud, murkier conditions, the temperature is currently 12 Celsius. So you can see where we have all this cloud across parts of England, Wales and parts of Northern Ireland. We've also got some patchy mist and fog around this morning too, particularly Lincolnshire, the Midlands and into the southeastern corner. But there's patchy fog elsewhere. Most of it will lift readily. Some of it will lift into low cloud in the south. But if you're in Northern Ireland, it will brighten up for you. You'll see some sunny spells developing through the course of the afternoon. The sunshine continuing across Scotland with some high cloud coming in. It will be hazy at times. Then later, we've got the first signs of some rain across the Outer Hebrides, accompanied by strengthening winds. For Northern England, you're off to a fine and dry and sunny start, a cold one. You'll hang on to the sunshine through the day. But across the likes of parts of Yorkshire, Lincolnshire, Cambridgeshire, the Midlands, into East Anglia, Essex, Kent, here we're going to hang on to the cloud and it will be thick enough at times to produce some spots of light rain or drizzle. But as we sweep over towards the west, although there still will be some cloud around, again thick enough for the odd shower, equally we'll see some bright spells, some sunny spells. Celsius. Now, through the evening and overnight, our weather front coming into the northwest, it's a cold front, sinks southwards, taking its rain across Scotland and Northern Ireland, and with it, it will be quite windy as well. Ahead of it, we're looking at a fair bit of cloud, still the odd spot of rain, some clearance in the sky, and where we have the clearer skies, the temperatures will be lower than you can actually see on the charts. So tomorrow we start off with that weather front continuing to push steadily southwards. It will bring some heavier bursts of rain across Cumbria, southwest Scotland, Northern Ireland. But as it pushes through the rest of England and Wales as a narrow band, well, the rain will turn that bit lighter. And we hang on to some sunny spells ahead of it and the higher temperatures. Behind it, we'll see some cooler weather and a peppering of showers in the north and west of Scotland, some of which in the hills, even modest hills, will be wintry. For Friday, a lot of dry weather around again, but by now the cold air has come in behind the front, which has cleared away, so it'll be cooler in southern counties. We still have some showers coming in across the north. Some of those will merge to give some longer spells of rain, and it's going to be windy with gales in exposure. That leads us into Saturday. Well, Saturday, sunny spells and showers. We're also going to have a chilly wind. Sunday... There's still a wee bit of uncertainty about the timing, but at the moment what we think is it will start off on a frosty but dry note. Then we'll have Atlantic fronts coming into the west later in the day, Dan and Lou. I'm Carol, thank you very much, and we'll see you in about half an hour. Thank you. Uh, good morning. We really have mixed fortunes in the weather this morning. Some of us are off to a cloudy start, patchy mist and fog, and also some light rain and drizzle, whereas others of us across Scotland, for example, and far north of northern England, starting off on a sunny note. So the cloud across Wales, southwest England and Northern Ireland will continue to break. We'll see some sunny spells develop through the afternoon, but we'll hang on to the cloud across the Midlands, through Lincolnshire, parts of Yorkshire and the southeast. Now, later in the day, a new band of rain will come in across northwest Scotland, accompanied by gusty winds, and it's going to be sinking southwards across all of Scotland and Northern Ireland through the course of the night, with colder conditions following on behind. Tonight again for England and Wales, cloudy with some patchy mist and fog. That's how we start the day tomorrow, but it brightens up and our weather front will continue to trundle down towards the southeast. Ahead of it, we've got sunshine in the south, still in milder conditions, and behind it, a lot of sunshine, but cooler. Peppering of showers in the cross north and the west of Scotland, and some of those will be wintry in nature.